So let's move on. Save that. Edit as you like. Exit out of this. All right, now you'll see a users file. Um, and the older versions of B permissions, groups, and users used to be in the same file. But since um, 2.7, um, code name B, the author, split it so it'd be easier for us to maintain. And it's easier to see as well. All right, so to add users, you can also do this through game. Um, it's a lot easier to do this through game as well. But I'm just going to show you what the layout looks like. It's very similar to um, the groups file. So you type users, and you space over a couple times, and you type the Minecraft username of one of your players or yourself. And then, like the ranks, we type um, permissions, groups, and meta. So it looks very similar to the groups format. And you can add uh, permission nodes that only apply to the other player. So you could type bucket dot command dot ban IP. So only a patch killer can ban IPs, but nobody else can. Now groups probably the most important part of the user file. This is the, where you uh, select the rank that you want your uh, user to have so I'm gonna set myself as an admin and make sure you spell it exactly how you spelled it in the groups file Otherwise, it will not be able to find it or understand what you're talking about and then under meta um, there's no priority under Meta and the users file so you can only use prefix and Suffix and you can go ahead and add specific uh, per prefixes and suffixes to one person and that will override the groups file so you could put um, patchy for example and that will override the other ones pretty simple so that's about it for the user file let's go ahead and exile that okay so now we've covered what's in these folders and if you go through and dub double click the world Another folder, you'll see the groups and users, and in world the end, you'll see groups and users. So each world has its separate group and users file. So let's click on the config file. Actually, this will make more sense when we'll come back to that later. So let's go to uh, mirrors. This is pretty simple to understand. So we got an example there. We're just gonna erase that. What mirrors does is if you don't want to go through and type uh, the same thing in every group's file for each world, you can just mirror the world by using the mirrors.yml file. How you do that is you type the world that you want to mirror, and then you type the world that you want to mirror from. So what this will do is it will copy everything from the world groups and users file and mirror it to the world nether. So you can also do world the end. So the world the end will copy everything that's in the world folder. So that makes it very simple and so you don't have to uh, keep repeating yourself by typing the same permissions over and over in the ranks over and over. Um, very simple and easy so now we got the mirrors file understood we can move on go ahead and exile that and now the tracks probably um, most difficult part probably um, it's easy once you understand it but it's probably it's a little tricky um, learning it so tracks are the promotions how it tells the server what uh, rank to promote a person when you type promote Apache killer and then the tracks name so um, so you have different types of tracks you can name this to whatever you want um, cool so 
let's change these to what we had in our groups file. So guests and change this to builder and capitalize the A on admin since we did in the groups file. Now let's create another one fast and let's do guest and admin. All right. Now what this does uh, when you here, let me show you. So when you type promote Apache killer and then you type the name of the tracks name. So cool. Actually capitalize cool. Um, so it will look at what rank Apache killer is. Um, say that I'm a guest right now. Uh, pretend that Apache killer is a guest. So it'll promote Apache killer using the cool um, track. So that so I'm a guest, it will promote me to a builder because I'm using the cool track. Now if I type fast, it will promote me straight from guest to admin because I use the fast track and not the cool track. Because if I used a cool track, I would have went straight to builder from guest. But with fast, I go straight to admin from guest. So now that we understand that, we can go to the config file and set that up. So go ahead and exit out of that. And let's go to the config file. All right. So this looks a lot different from uh, the old permissions file. They came with B permissions. B permission, the old B permissions had a full list of different things that you could change and stuff. But in this one, it's very simple, very clean, and only one option. All right. So there's three different options that you can change this to. So you got multi, you got single, and you have lump. So what multi does? This all this uh, permission node deals with the tracks. So listen closely because this can be kind of confusing. So multi, when you type slash promote Apache Killer, like I just showed you, multi will add the group. So say I'm at so in the users file, it'll look like this. Um, groups all right so multi when it when I when somebody promotes you you will it will add a um, it will add the next rank so it will add um, builder which would be our next rank if we're using a cool uh, track and that's what multi does it adds the rank now if we're using um, single which is the one I would prefer when you promote somebody it gets rid of the old rank and adds the new so you don't have two different ranks um, now lump when you promote somebody it will add all the um, all the ranks that are in the same track that you um, add. So it'll add all those because you're using the lump track. Um, again, I would prefer the single, but it's your choice. And do what you're, choose the one that would benefit your server. So go ahead and exit out that. So now we've covered everything it looks like off my notes here so uh, let's go over a quick overview so world these folders hold uh, two files groups and users so you create your ranks and groups you set your user ranks and users uh, you can set what type of track um, promoting you want and can in the config file um, Mirrors, 
you mirror other worlds to make it simpler on you. Tracks, uh, you, how you want to promote your users. And that's it. What these groups and user are here for, is, I have no idea why they're here. I've tested with them and they do nothing. So I'm not sure if that was a mistake adding them there or something, but um, don't touch these because they do not do anything to your uh, server. So that's about it. Also, I'll be um, making a second B permission tutorial showing you how to use in game commands. And also, I'll probably sh be showing you how to um, how to use uh, B Chat Manager and the Web GUI because there's uh, new versions of both of those plugins. So I hope this helped you out. Um, sorry this is so long, but it covers about everything in B permissions. Um, separating them in, in two is just a pain. So thanks for watching.